Hi people, welcome to Chess247 and you are encountering another online chess plates video. Let's go for e4 and we have c5. Okay, d6. I'll play bishop b5. This is canal variation as far as I can recall, and we can have knight c6, knight d7, bishop d7. But nine times out of ten, knight c6 is played. Okay, Na bishop d7. The idea is quite simple. I mean, I'll now castle g6. So he wants to free and keto. I'll definitely get a good center first of all. And now I'll play d4. And it'll castle now, yeah. Pretty logical. But now the c file is a bone of contention. My opponent can play rook c8 controlling the file. But we have rook e8. Okay. Another thing that I want to do is to get my dark bishop swapped for my opponent's dark bishop e5 mm, I can see definitely I don't want to take on e5 right now so I let him take on it because if he takes on d4 I can take with the bishop and then at least we can have some opposite force on the diagonal from a1 to g8 But we have knight g4, so my bishop is lost. But okay, that's fine. At least now we don't have. I mean, it's fine. At least my opponent doesn't have a bishop pair advantage. So we just have a dark bishop. Queen b6. He's attacking a b2 pawn, but I want to somehow. I mean, he cannot really win any pawn because if I want to play d5 here, if I play d5, queen takes b2, rook e rook to b1, and I'm winning the pawn on b7. So he's not really actually going to win that pawn. I'm quite inclined to play d5, locking in the pawn structure. Okay, I'm going to play d5 and if takes then pawn takes queen or maybe I can consider rook takes e3 okay so he's playing rook a to c8 but now I'll take it because now at least I have some mobility for my queen knight and I'm hitting both pawns on a7 and on d6 I think he has to save the d pawn because it is the base pawn if d pawn falls then I think e5 pawn will be a big big problem yeah and now he may even infiltrate okay like this but because this diagonal is logged I will love to play b2 I would love to retain this material advantage f5 you know what let's just challenge this rook he should not take it but let's see he, yeah he, I mean, he cannot really save it he has to, I mean he can move it to e2 but I can defend it, if defend everything with rook e1 ok mm, I can, I don't have to worry about the d4 pawn rook a8, ok
So he's getting back his material. All the material right now is quite equal. We both have, but right now I'm hitting the E5 pawn, and I have the C file with me. R my uh, bishop f8. I'm thinking to play b knight takes d6. Okay, rook b2. I can play knight c5, protect everything, and hit the knight. So, if my opponent goes back to protect the h7 pawn, then it will be pretty bad for him, I guess. I think because now his king is cut off from the play, and I can add some additional defense to the b pawn. I think the e5 pawn cannot really go down the line because I have ample protection on e4. <coughs> I think now I can play b4, so that should not be an issue because e4 is not. Yeah, it's not possible, I guess, because the knight cannot take it because of rook e7. And now this knight is in a skewer. So let's see. <coughs> and there are no checks available by the e4 knight, so. I think the player has left the game. I think I'll wait for a couple of sec. I mean, I, I already cannot do anything. I have to just sit and wait over here. analysis board I think after e5 I, I should have taken the computer says to take on e5 but I was that much confident about this move and I think he should have instead of going back he should have played he should have played king okay this the computer is saying to play king g8 well I was suggesting to play king f6 at least have some uh, protection yeah you are losing this pawn but at least now your king is active and you can move this pawn also and I think yeah, the, pr the problem is that this knight cannot move now because otherwise this rook will fall. So that's why. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, then please hit that like button, subscribe to my channel and see you in my next video. Till then, take care. Ta Goodbye. Good day.